Ty Taylor has just been unhittable at the on the mound in the bottom of the first here. Ball one. Well, I and like I said, we have absolutely zero win now at uh, Hideaway Field. Boy, ball two for Taylor Brennan. Stein making a very bold claim that he'll strike out every MLB player. player. Little Boosie says go. snappers to shut out the Calicos. Go, come on. That's going to be a quick ball four from Taylor. Baby, let's go. Wow, Taylor's walked the leadoff batter here in the bottom of the first. That's what I'm saying. They're high in the first. That's going to bring up Alex Carrasco, who's going to try to bat with his eyes open today. He's going to take ball one. Taylor's really going to find his stuff here. Remember, he could find himself out of this game after two batters. 48 miles per hour. That's going to be Taylor's first strike. And we're going to even the count of twos here. That's going to be a full count. Taylor is finding himself in a sticky situation early. Let's see if he can get out of this spot. Alex is going to fight off probable strike. Keep the count full here on Alex Carrasco. Wow. He's going to fight off another pitch. And he's going to ground into a potential double play. Looks like we have turned a double play here. That's going to be two outs. And that's going to keep Taylor alive at the mound. That's going to bring up Barry Hutter, who recently returned from an injury. He's going to take a big hack. And uh, Matt Patricus says, Alex, open your eyes when you're batting. That is going to be strike number three. He's over this chat. Oh, you know, if I started an OnlyFans, Lil Boot Boot be my only fan. Oh. Hey, that's not a bad fan to have. There's Nick. I've been thinking about dabbling into OnlyFans because I've heard it could be a pretty profitable venture for my unique hobbies. Taylor out of sorts with that pitch right there. Man, Taylor, Taylor didn't start off. He, uh, he walked the first batter of the game. That's big. And he's just kind of losing control. And there's Nick taking it to two and two, or one and two. Two and two. Smash. Nick leading the league in foul balls once again with over 134 this season alone. There we go. That's right, Nick Flood. <laughs> Always got to promote the vegan stuff, man. There's animals dying right now, and I'm not all about that. Inside pitch right there. What do you think is going to happen um, in this series? What, what, what are you forecasting? Um, I know Alex is just a beast on the mound. So is Taylor, but I think... Yeah. I'm going to go with the Calicos in game one right here. Calicos game one, you heard it here first. <coughs> I really think these these games are pickup games, though. I don't think we can even offer any type of line on, in these games. Any, it can go either way. I, I think you're right. I think Calicos game one. I feel like the momentum's there. Taylor walked the first pitcher. A smash by Joe. There's a tiny, tiny... You have someone who, uh, uh, 
these little symbols and half words and I, I'm not following it right there. Yeah. You have to really clarify what you're trying to uh, Oh, and there's by. Jesse. Like, Jesse, an absolute monster. Wow. Catches the inside straight right there. Good days, baby. 2016 cookie out there. Maybe not so I am much a sand bad. viper. I'm calling it. I think I'm the best. I'm the best at every really. And the way I'm calling it. It looks like we have a song. I'd have to get Caro over here to uh, assess this paragraph. And Alex goes right back up to Taylor, and that's going to be out number one. I do think Adam is probably asleep. No, he's uh, he's too energized to go. And we'll get Sand Viper 23 on the channel very soon. We'll probably have a clip of this very shortly. We apparently established this rule two weeks ago. Oh well, well we missed it. We're moving on. We are human. We do miss calls, and uh, yeah, we're just we're just gonna move on. Honestly, who cares? Move on. Yes, you have to be. It's a 21 plus. Barry coming off a long layoff in the league comes back. I heard he had a uh, very specific injury that made him sit out for two weeks. Okay, that sounds like a rotator cuff injury. We'll give it a little bit. And we're up to 50 viewers. Thank you so much. I want to see some. Subs oh, a long Whoa. fly ball. Good. Oh, oh, right on the oh, warning oh, track. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Man, he smashed that. Change, you want to read it? Why, you want to get up here on break? Most of these guys are local, but we do have people that fly in as we have a small airport uh, runway in the back there. And they come in on their little Cessnas uh, plus the helipads. But listen, guys. Yeah, I, I think Taylor... Uh, I don't know, man. He's a baller. I'm going to have to ask him if he pitches two big, good games again. He might be MVP of this doubleheader. Monster pitching duel. What's that? I think Taylor did pitch in college. Taylor did pitch in college. Uh, my affiliates in Omaha right now have confirmed <sighs> that he did play for the Little Beavers. He gave up three hits total in two games last week against the uh, Warbirds. Total. Three hits total. Oh man, Thomas, dude, we go off over here. Uh, we just had last night. We had a baked potato party. A bunch of baked potatoes, vegan sour cream, vegan bacon, cashew cheese sauce, um, chili, steamed broccoli, all that kind of good stuff. What? No, that's Chad. Chad is Chad. Oh, off the top wow. bar, but a little too hot. Well, Perfectly off the top for 64. Back, when you're making that throw after stepping on home plate, you pass the strike zone. Dead ball. <laughs> Matty Levine yeah. takes one he's, he's outside. Down, that's a dumb move. Yeah, we'll have to reconvene on that ruling. That's Walker, a sand viper, now a lead umpire for tonight Just in the last two games. Outside. Look at the, uh, the game, the mouse and cat. Yeah, win Thomas, 100%. Get me on the Ocho, we'll go wild. This thing will blow up into the tents. A big shot. What a play by Cass. He does the flamingo dance with a kneel. He got at least six inches uh, vertical jump there. Let's see the replay. <laughs> Absolutely. What a huge play. Otherwise, that's a double and scores a run. Here's Alex. Can he do himself a favor and score a run? It's going to be 0-2. Cat, what's up? Oh, wait. It wasn't past the strike zone anyway. Okay, we'll have to reconfer with Chad to make sure that there might be more different uh, when we get to the rule books. Alex, an unbelievable catch by Webb. I wouldn't think he'd be that after a long, long layoff. Let's see if he can put a run on the board. Oof. Just loving on the page. That's right. Here we go. Is somebody going to come alive right now and try to win the game? 
I'm going to let this at bat play out. We're going to let it play out, Uncle B. Nothing's going to be said for this remaining of the bat. And there you have it. Batter is out. That's right, Winnie for the win. Tell him how great the sanctuary is, Sarah. You went back there, there full tour. And here's Nick. He could win it for him. I feel it. A big shot. Jesse right there. Is he going to make the throw? He does. 113 feet. Much deeper than most of the wiffle ball parks out there right now. It's not an easy task to get one out. The wind earlier, you never knew a throw from the uh, third base was going to make it to the fence because it was. It, it could get oh, I know. I was on the. To, uh, there the I was on the mound. It was brutal. Here we go. Counts two and one here at Premier League Wiffle. You start with a strike, so it's two and one. He goes oppo. It looks like we're going to go to overtime. To the Sometimes they call that in extra league. innings. We <laughs> it's such in a bad spot. I can't like. Those tree trunks up there weigh like a ton. We gotta get a, we gotta <laughs> One get time a I was with Tom, and like I was thinking about cutting like this big like 15 inch trunk, dude. He's like, oh, if you cut that, it's gonna swing into you and you're gonna die. I immediately stopped that. Grounder, Jesse got it. makes the throw out number one. B charge. Where are you from? A look on Maddie Levine's We're in Las Vegas right near Hideaway Field, Premier League Wiffle. Some of the better players in the nation, they fly in every so often to come play this game. Right, here we are. Taylor, Alex, huge pitcher versus pitcher matchup. And Alex would love. Alex is pitching for the Calicos. Taylor, these are two best pitchers oh, in the league. Two, two of the toughest guys to hit. Two of the best all the time. Absolutely. I wonder if the war chicken can do that. He goes oh, down with a nasty. A high one. This is a big, big spot for Barry right now. If there was anybody that could go yard, it would be Barry right now. What? Oh, Big cut right there. Taylor is so legit. He just threw a perfect slider down and out. What's he going to come back with? Is he going to go straight for the strikeout or is he going to toy around? We're going to see. I mean, he's going to try to get him on some nasty stuff right here. And that's it. That's going to take game number one.